northern Italy, where I'm from, women used to plant flowers alongside difficult paths in the mountains in order to make the journey more pleasing. The flowers are finally on my path because spring is here and it's that time for sowing your intentions directly into the earth where mother nature can hear them. You don't have to be walking a mountain to see the signs. They are everywhere. We are all children of the earth, each year experiencing a new reality, a new level of awareness, changing and adapting to the seasons and environmental pressures. One feet grow now when you sleep in bed. One, one, all of the flowers wake up all early and. Learn to adapt with patience and kindness, honouring your growth, honouring your past and all versions of yourself. experiencing difficulties, nurture yourself back to a peaceful existence. And from that place, you can confront issues in a much more mindful way. Stress is a reaction to pressure. Teach yourself to react differently so you do not burden yourself with more weight than you can manage.
have been working on a project that has no real intention besides just to please me and honour the ocean, which has been one of my greatest teachers on my healing journey. As you can hear, it has been incredibly windy in my part of the world. Wind has taught me about power, strength and resilience. If you've ever biked through a storm or when the wind has been against you, you know what I'm talking about. It's the cutest thing. <laughs> People teach us to love and they can also teach us to hate, but it is a choice which path we would like to walk in life. We can be forgiving or we can be resentful and that is up to us to make that decision. It doesn't matter what other people have done, what they have tried, what they have failed at, or what they have given up on. 
What matters is what you do today and what you do tomorrow to get to where you want to be. is your wealth and don't you dare ever listen to anyone who tells you otherwise who says you're being selfish for prioritizing yourself over a job or a relationship Instead, listen to the voices in nature. Mother Earth has so many guardians and spirits around, constantly within reach. There are messengers everywhere, waiting to show you the way. There is always a way. There will always be a path that is made just for you, and some of us will have to plant the flowers for ourselves and the next person. Spend more time doing the things that you love. Give more time to those that you love. And become the person that you want to see in the world. We get back.